This week we're talking about window pane checks. What do you get when you cross an age of catwalk minimalism with the era of austerity on the ground? A season in which the references are incredibly down to earth. Two of the punchiest references on the catwalk this season were kind of office windowscape and that red, white and blue check which you associate with laundrettes. We've got some very different examples to show you today. First of all, a couple which are taking inspiration from that laundry hold-all check, which was this season's most extraordinarily ridiculous catwalk reference. This one here, this coat by NW3. Now that check is here, but it's kind of washed out and muted to such an extent that the coat becomes quite cosy and dreamy, really. But I think subliminally, this is sending out very fashionable messages, even if you don't consciously associate it with its catwalk inspiration. And this one here, it's French Connection, I think is quite interesting because it's kind of partly laundrette check, sort of a little bit Burberry, brought together in a shirt dress. Also like the fact that it's like this on the front, but then quite simple on the back. The window pane check is the one really on the high street and it comes in all shapes and sizes. First, we have here a bomber jacket. You're gonna to have to get used to this shape of jacket again. It is going to be everywhere next summer. So I think now might be the time to get your eye in, try one on, and this is mango. So it's a kind of dip your toe in the bomber jacket waters window pane version. French Connection again, who's gone quite big on the window panes. It's straightforward, it's a straight edge graphic. It looks very simple. It's kind of like a bit pinstripe, but more feminine and a bit of an update. This knit here is quite different, kind of playing with scale because you've got this huge outsized knit and you've got this really outsized pattern. So it has this idea of excess and comfort that just makes you feel really cozy just looking at the sweater before you even put it on. This one by contrast has a kind of neatness to it, very small, almost pixelated version of it. It's made very dainty by the addition of this cream collar and little cream trims on the pocket here. And then lastly, I like this one because I think the way the print is used is very clever. It's almost like you're looking up at a skyscraper and it has a rather lengthening, flattering effect, much more so than a broad stripe. Any kind of straight edge graphic has historically been a fashion winner, from tartan to gingham, pinstripes, breton stripes. They are always useful. They're always things that people will want to wear. 